Um, hello there. Uh, my name is Raj, and I am a university student. And this is slightly annoying. F this is slightly annoying for me, but um, I haven't really been paying all that much attention to the lectures we had through out the year so far because I've been busy, like actually doing assignments and with work and everything, and there just simply wasn't time. So what I'm gonna basically do is try to uh, see if I can download all the lectures at once um, because I think this would be like a clever use of command of command line tools to figure out how to do things so um, pretty much yeah uh, so first things first um, this is one of the courses I want to download the lectures for um so basically at uni we have we use this thing called panopto internally they call it vstream um but the way it works is that you get to see all your lectures here and this has been a thing since last since like a while now because people sometimes won't be able to make the lecture and so you can watch it in retrospect as opposed to just going off of the lecture slides so, um, a really cool thing that uh, this provides is this R is this RSS file, and this gives us the actual links to the um, this gives us the links to the MP4 file. So, with a bit of regex magic, I think we should be able to. With a bit of regex magic, we should be able to extract those URLs, put them in a file, and then use wget to do that. Now, I don't know how to do it entirely in the command line, but I do have a vague idea of um, pretty much getting most of the way there. So let me quickly open a Visual Studio Code window here and copy paste these. And then we can use this thing called a regex to pretty much find all of them. Actually not. I don't think this is the be Visual Studio Code is the best thing. Uh, there is this website called Regexer, and then will give us straight up. It will straight up give us a list of all the possible options. So I'm going to paste the everything here, and then I'm going to uh, start typing things in. And then when I'm starting to have issues, like there, we can fix this. So we've got HTTPS, and then we go, and then we need to select everything up to MP4. And we'll do that lazily. And here's pretty much every MP4 list. Uh, I'm also going to put up the. Um, a restriction to. I'm also going to quickly put up a restriction to block this character, the question mark character. So I want to groups and references. I don't want to skip characters. Now, if you don't know what you're looking for, you can pretty much go for ah oh, character class. Oh, okay. So we need to do not that. I think this is look ahead. I don't know, but this works. So we can now go list. And this should give us a list. Oh, I need to press enter. Now if I type in zero sweet and then if we go new line here's the list of all of the here's the list of all of the streams and then we can go let me quickly switch over to Linux and let's go to the downloads folder can't type good downloads can go And 
10, 1, 2, 4, 3. And we can dump these all in a file. Oh, I don't have Vim installed. Let's fix that. And while that's installing, I'm also going to prepare a list. I'm also going to prepare another list for another one of my courses. Insert, paste, and then we can go right quit. And then, because the regex scanned like twice the same thing, we need. Uh, well, I just need to deduplicate it. So, let me quickly do that. To 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 ah uh, sort and then unique. It's already sorted, so we can do unique C. Hmm. Okay, I don't want to count it. What if I just do unique? Yeah, that works. And then we can go w get list. Huh, why has my terminal gone funny? And then we can get rid of the original one. W get list. That looks beautiful. All right, sweet. So that works. Um, we can, and I can now do the same for. So I can just simply go open up tmux. That isn't installed either. Okay. Um. New terminal window. And I can just simply go wget help. And then we can go do, 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 do. there is an option somewhere. Input file. Neat. So you can go I w get list and that will download all of the lectures so we'll see how that goes in the meantime let's do the same thing for the other one so if this go downloads lectures and then we can go cyber 271 which is the other one of my courses and then to do that we need the RSS. You can also write an XML find. You can also write an XML f pathfinder for this. Uh, it's just more hassle I don't want to deal with. So let's go vim w get list raw dot text. Paste that. Right quit, and then we need to do unique. And then we can go w get list. And then we can do w get i w get list dot text. And that will download all of them. So I guess that is a really hacky way to download all of the videos. Hopefully I can po um, possibly I can wrap this up in a site more program or whatever but I guess that is a easy um, way to download pretty much all of your lectures at once in one swift way so I don't know if this has any educational value but I gotta put something up I don't know <laughs>